Hi everyone! Hello! Bonjour tout le monde, so today we are going to speak about Apkujo. Yeah, so it has been a very long time that we wanted to make a video about this area. So today we are going to make it for real. Let's go! Apkujong is situated on the south side of Han River. It's part of Gangnam district, the part of Seoul city full of classic clubs and big brand shops. It is well known for its Lodeo streets and all the area around. It's a place for shopping and there are also many chic restaurants, trendy shops, pretty cafes and boutiques. Everybody knows that celebrities love hanging around Apkujong. You can find some entertainment building there. It's a rich district, and the most famous mall is Galleria, which is the equivalent of Les Galeries Lafayette in Paris. It's a crazy expensive mall. The good thing about Apkurong is that it's full of shabu shabu restaurants, and it's really delicious. Finally, it can be a paradise for you if you're into fashion. There are thousands of fancy clothing shops and famous fashion brands all around the place. So what to say about Apkujong? Well, we only went there by night. So yeah, in the evening. Yeah, in the evening the atmosphere is not quite the same as yeah. it is in the afternoon. So I but I think it's the best time yeah. to go. I mean the atmosphere is different by night. Yeah, it's just like Gangnam. If you go there by night, it's totally different atmosphere. Mm. Uh, by daytime I think it's quite like normal district and yeah. people just hanging around, having a coffee, but at night time it seems like people are more like shopping and going to club, yeah. so the atmosphere is changing and uh, people are wearing different clothes. Actually, Apujong is a pretty small district. Yes. Most of the time people say Apujong is part of Gangnam, yeah. but personally uh, we prefer the north of the city, just yes. as we make, made a video of Buandong. Yes. So yeah, you can feel in the north the Korean feeling, you know? Not really in the south, yes. for me. Uh, so if I could compare Apkujong with another place in the world, well, I don't know so much because I didn't visit the States, I only visited Europe and uh, Asia. Asia, but only Seoul and Tokyo. So in Tokyo, for example, I would say that it's kind of similar with Shibuya or Ginza. Yeah, Since just like uh, yeah. you can find just luxury products or luxury brands. There are two things that I couldn't forget about Apkujong. Uh, the first one is uh, just like there are so many huge, uh, really expensive cars. BMW and uh, I don't know, a big Hyundai car, white and all No light. normal cars. Not normal cars. Just huge and just, yeah. Mm -hmm. Expensive Sparkling cars, really expensive yeah. cars. So I was a bit worried because everyone was just crossing the roads, but it was, was a bit dangerous. Too huge, <laughs> and my, it was kind of dangerous for yeah. us. But the um, second thing that I would remember about Apkujong is that I saw some uh, K-pop fans. Uh, I mean, they were just like really young, just like thirty. Not young, common K-pop fans, just like crazy K-pop. Yeah, fans. crazy K-pop fans. They were running around everywhere, yeah. just looking for their idol. So. If yeah. you know in Korea, I think that there are some people who like to hang out at Apkujong yeah. because there are many Yonein, what we call in yeah. Korean Yonein, or uh, famous people. It looks like a bit like a dream of the um, wealth, you know, in Seoul. Yeah. Uh, it's something that is quite uh, just a huge feeling Some, some in some places in the south of Seoul. You could not uh, feel that in the north part. Yeah. The, the atmosphere is totally different. So, uh, Apkujong is quite interesting if you are hanging out in Seoul yeah. for the first time, I think. Well, actually, uh, Apkujong is one of the places that is most used in dramas just to be shot. Yeah. Just like. Yeah, in any dramas, they just go to Apujong, Gangnam, uh, the south of the city, just like where everyone is rich, almost. And uh, I think that's why many people go to Or everyone Seoul. in Gangnam, there are some no more people. Yeah, of course, there, of course. But you know, after people go to Seoul, just dreaming of what they saw in the dramas, and they're just like, what? They go to Hongdae or just in the north and just like... It's not so really shocked, you know, if you go to yeah. Jongno or some places... It's, it's a different soul, actually. Yeah, it's, not, exactly. it's not the same atmosphere, not the same people hanging out there. But if you are going to Apujong just to go to a cafe or just to eat something, it 
can be cheap. I mean, if, even though there are expensive cafes and expensive restaurants, it's always possible to find cheap restaurants yeah, and good quality actually. So mm -hmm. that's something in Seoul that's always there. And yeah. That's one of the things I prefer in Seoul. Uh, yeah, I wanted to talk about an experience of mine uh, yeah. when I was in Napujong for the an first time. An interesting story. Yeah, <laughs> it was the first time in uh, in Seoul. It was yeah. 2011. Yeah, uh, two August, years ago. two years ago, almost, almost. <laughs> and um, I went to um, just behind a cafe, yeah. um, just waiting for a friend. Uh, and I was really shocked because I saw inside of the cafe. inside of the cafe I could see someone, and I thought it's a Cian Blue singer. I mean, it's Chong Yong Wah. I was absolutely sure of that, but I was just doubting suddenly, just like it's not yeah, possible. You think it's not possible, yeah. But when I told that to my Korean friends, they told me, yes, it was absolutely him. So it's not surprising. In Napkujong, everyone is just, it's pretty common. I used to see uh, just uh, really famous people. So I saw him with his glasses and I just stared at him. I, I tried to be kind of polite, not rude, but yeah. it was difficult because I, I wanted to know, you know. <laughs> so I just, wanted uh, to take a picture? Yeah, I wanted, no, not a picture. <laughs> I was a bit uh, shy, but... I stared at him and suddenly he looked at me with a kind of smile just like yeah I know, I know him I know who I, I am, am. So, <laughs> so yeah it's kind of a fun experience so I would say that if you're a K-pop fan and you want to meet a K-pop star just in the street just like oh my gosh you can stalk them if you want <laughs> by going to Apujong. It's the best place to do that, I think. And if you are not interested in K-pop or even in dramas, yeah. you can just spend maybe one or two hours in Apujong. It could be interesting, but I think that's not so funny. Um, I think that there are way more um, uh, attractive know, places. Attractive places in the north. That's my opinion about the uh, so, but uh, of course, I know many, many people that prefer the South Spa, but I yeah. think, yeah. It depends. It depends on your feelings. Uh, yeah, it depends on, on what you're looking at. Yeah. So. Uh, I mean, uh, I knew a lot of foreigners just, they loved uh, Itaewon and the Coex, and uh, I understood why, because, I mean, it's a really special place. But since I wanted to, to go to Seoul in order to discover Korean culture, uh, I always feel just different in places just like Samsung Dong. Um, even though there's many tourists in Inside Dong, I like the, the, atmos the atmosphere there. And uh, yeah, many places in the north are really attractive. But if you're looking for classy stuff, yeah, just exactly. go in the south. Yeah, just like Shinsa and Gangnam. <coughs> The best place for me. Yeah. And, um, pour nos amis français qui regardent cette vidéo, je sais pas combien vous êtes, mais voilà, on si, est là. Si vous êtes euh, allé à Seoul déjà une fois, euh, si vous êtes allé au nord, au sud, qu'est-ce que vous en avez pensé Oui, quelle est la partie de Seoul que vous avez préférée Voilà, ça. Et pour quelles raisons surtout Voilà. Et aussi pour nos amis anglophones, évidemment, qui regardent cette vidéo et euh, qui euh, auraient voyagé ou alors qui vont bientôt voyager à Seoul voilà. et qui voudraient euh, avoir. Euh, qu'est-ce que vous préféreriez visiter voilà. comme Qu'est-ce que vous préférez visiter comme endroit Quelle idée vous avez déjà euh, dans votre voyage pour, euh, pour passer un bon moment à Seoul Voilà. Donc voilà, c'était notre opinion, notre vision voilà. de Abkuzan. Donc euh, si vous avez des questions par rapport euh, à ce quartier-là ou à un autre quartier ou si vous avez envie qu'on parle d'un quartier en euh, particulier qui vous intéresse à Séoul, voilà. bon, on peut faire une vidéo dessus. Donc, euh, voilà. Et puis on a, on a un blog que je mettrai dans la description. Pour revenir à l'anglais, uh, we are going to come back to France next month. So I don't know if we are going to be able to make another video. Video blog. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I don't know about it. I would like to make a video in, in Korean, but uh, we I may don't not know. have yes. the time. We, we may try. not have the time, but yeah, yeah. we'll talk about it in. Uh, Another post in our blog or in another video, I don't know yet, but I hope you liked our video, you liked our all videos and uh, see you yeah. another time. Thank see you. you. Bye. Bye bye.